Hey guys, what's up? Um, wanted to do a quick little intro uh, for this video. Um, I know normally we don't really go and do video portions of the podcast, but while I was over at Snake River Fandom Con uh, for this episode, uh, Carter, who you've been who you will hear on this podcast, um, happened to have a, uh, a camera and he was so gracious enough to record, I think, uh, I think we do like maybe the last like 30, 45 minutes uh, of this particular episode. Um, so what you guys are going to see for this video is just sort of part of the episode. Hope that you guys enjoy it. Um, I had a great time actually recording this episode. Um, I was only meaning this episode to be kind of like 15 or so minutes, and as far as the runtime, you guys can definitely see that it went much longer than that, and I'm so glad that it did. So uh, I want to say a huge thank you to Marcus, and a huge thank you over to Carter. Um, I hope to, that I can see you guys really, really soon. I had a great time bumping into you guys all weekend for Snake River Fandom Con, um, and I definitely hope to be able to get out there. So uh, let's get into this portion of the video part of this episode, which is I'm I'm debating on naming it either Best Bromance or, I, I don't know, Best Bromance. There you go. Hope you guys like it. beforehand and you know we're just standing in the big crowd waiting for my group to get called so my group gets called after like 30 minutes waiting we go up there and I'm waiting in a big long line for about 45 minutes and I finally get to the front of the line I'm literally standing right by Jason Momoa and what does he do is he he stops the whole photo off to you know change his music on his iPod or his phone and to take a drink of a soda he just told the photo people stop wait I need to do this real quick and I looked at the, the Epic photo op employees and I looked at the security in there and they the, fa the look on their faces was like, Jason, really? We've been standing here for like two hours. You want to get done? And, and, I, and I, turned to, I turned to the lady standing right by me and I'm like, you know what? We're not on your time. We're on Jason Momoa's time. He literally stopped that whole thing and to take a drink of the soda. And I'm just standing there like, I get to stand by Jason Momoa, right by him for an extra two minutes. It's <laughs> like the greatest thing ever. Just, but the look on the cameraman and the look on the security people is like, oh, come on, Jason. So they couldn't, they wanted, it looked like they wanted to tell him something so bad, but they, they knew they couldn't. Yeah, and Jason, I think Jason knows his worth, and he's like, you know what, you can't tell me what to do. No, I'm, yeah. I'm Aquaman. So. <laughs> well, that and Jason Momoa is basically out over at Salt Lake probably like every two months. You know, so it's very casual to like, oh, okay, there's Aquaman. Uh, oh, walk by, you know, yeah. <laughs> so, yeah, he's there. He's got family there. And, I did not know well, that. Yeah. I have the camera set up. Shotgun mics right there. Should be picking this up right now. Thanks for letting awesome. me set all this up. Dude, yeah, any way uh, that I can help you out? Man. Absolutely, yeah. yeah. <laughs> Maybe I can send this to you and we can, you can actually like put this along with you. Sure. So we're, actually, we're, we're actually, we're actually filming this now, right? Yeah. <laughs> so this has turned into something big and what, how long have we been doing this now? About 30 minutes or so? Uh, you guys are about Almost 53 minutes. Almost at about minutes. an hour now. Yeah. <laughs> and now we're filming yeah. it. <laughs> Yeah, so, well, like I said, welcome to how these things usually go. It's like, all right, things are going pretty well, and, huh, maybe I should do this, and then this, and then this. You know what? We're, we're just going to do this all. We're doing it live. That's uh, yeah, it. We're doing yeah. it live. Doing it live, yeah. yeah so. Well, thanks, you, thanks for letting me, like, set it up and whatnot. Yeah, it should be awesome. I need to get B-roll anyway, so. Yeah, it's, see, now as, like, so for this, like, okay, yeah, this is the podcast that I do, you know, over here, but yeah. then we're now starting to also do, like, I'm part of a team that we also do starting to do live action stuff as well i know exactly how it is getting b-roll of like oh we're having so much fun and i have not been recording anything. Yeah, i know <laughs> yeah. right, let me let me go and do that exactly yeah <laughs> should have brought the camera over 50 what 54 i totally forgot it about it dude like it's just everything's just been going over my head i'm just i'm excited to be here especially in one country. right yeah. see that that's where you need to occupy your time with having like you know, do what my wife does, which is have like a little rolled up newspaper, and anytime I'm forgetting something, like pop, you know you should be recording B roll. Yep, yep, yep. Uh, go and do that. Just, yeah. Uh, record an episode, stupid. Okay, all right. <laughs> I love you too. <laughs> <laughs> I don't do that to Carter. Honestly, Carter and I just let each other do our own thing. Like, we're really laid back with each other. Like, if we feel like we need to tell the other something, we usually do. Like, 
like with the Snake River Defenders. Honestly, we had, since we had been cosplaying together, we actually were both uh, invited to become full-time cosplayers. <laughs> However, with my schooling, I'm like, I don't have time to do yeah. this. I don't have time to do this. Yeah, she's also in a sorority, the Lambda yeah. Theta Alphas, and yeah. that yeah. takes up a lot of your time. Yeah, so I, so I just had a lot of commitments, and I was like, I can't do this, I can't do this. But I knew he really wanted to, and I was like, oh, I don't want to break up the team and be like, oh, I'm sorry, I can't. And then he was sitting there, and he had uh, gone through some things, and he kind of wanted to try cosplaying on his own a little bit. Yeah. Only we didn't know how to tell the other, like, we, I don't both, we both wanted the we same wanted thing, the but same we're afraid thing. of be hurting each other's feelings. So we were like <laughs> trying to sugarcoat everything, and then we tell each other, and we're like, oh, wait, yeah. we just wanted the same thing. We were so afraid yeah. of hurting each other's yeah. feelings. Because so. he was like, oh, do you want to go to the Snake River thing? And I'm like, oh, yeah, that sounds like fun. And, he, and then I'd be like, oh, yeah, I was thinking I'd be staying home today. And he's uh-huh. like, or I have things to do, homework or whatever. And he'd be like... Okay, that's too bad. And so then eventually we caught on to each other and we're like, ah, you don't want me to be part of the Snake River Defenders right at this minute. And he's like, but you're busy. And I was like, I know, that's why I don't want to either. And And then then we we realized and we're like, oh, okay. (laughs) Yeah. 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 That must have been a deep breath. A little bit, yeah. Because at the time, well, at the time, you know, this was after I tore my ACL, so yes. judo, taekwondo, and the martial arts that I participated in, I, I essentially like couldn't do that anymore. Yep. And, and then the Snake River Defenders come and it was like, it was, you know, a new passion I can do that wasn't going to strain anything on my knee. Exactly. And I was so excited and, um, you know, as her being in a sorority, she kind of had her own thing that she got to do. And I kind of just wanted something that I kind of wanted to just explore by myself. Yeah. Yeah, and like she understood that immediately, but of course I don't want to hurt feelings. I don't want to hurt anyone's feelings. Right. Yeah. Yeah. We sugarcoat things a lot. We're like, oh, sweetheart, yeah, and yeah. then it's like, oh, wait, we both, we both are, oh, okay, I get what you mean. Yeah. Exactly. Yeah, trust me, that, that, that continues to happen for a while, and then, well, nine years in, you just go like, well... I'm not, I'm not, yeah, we're, we're just going to say that. Yeah. <laughs> exactly, yeah. There just becomes very, like, a whole lot more comfort to it. It's like, look, I know you're not going to get offended by this, so I'm just, I'm, no, there is no sugar for this. <laughs> yeah, exactly. But I'm just, I'm really happy that, you know, she's, especially because we tried to get a, the first time we cosplayed to get, well, she cosplayed. Yeah. Um, yeah, this is was, my first time cosplaying Yeah, ever. was with me, and actually what we did was we got a full league Blood Moon team. Yeah, we had, five people. We had Diana, Shen, Blood Moon Jin, Blood Moon Town, and Blood Moon Akali, all just Blood Mooned out. Yeah. Whew, that was a I was just really happy. Well, well she, she really helped us because no one, in, before we I met her and she was kind of started helping us, no one knew how to sew. <laughs> yeah. I'm, I'm in the so same bad. boat. <laughs> yeah. Hey, I'm not good at either. Don't worry about it. Yeah. And then, uh, and then I met her, and then she just, yeah, you, know, you know, all of our costumes, our kimonos, everything just came out so great. Nice. Most of it is like yes. they they all sewed it themselves. Like I taught them the basics, and I was like, okay. Just because I can sew does not mean I'm sewing everybody. So yep. you guys yep. are sewing things. Yep. Yeah. So, yeah, we get together like once or twice a week with that team. Oh, yeah. And uh-huh. we would work on the costume. And even then, we were cutting it down to the wire on some parts. Oh, yeah. <laughs> yep. Well, the, the beauty of the group, and it's the same thing with the Stink River Defenders, that everyone, every member brings their own skill set to the group. Yeah, like for, for me, I'm a foam smith primarily. Yeah. I'm not the best at it, but I'm mostly a foam smith. And then something new I got to bring was fight choreography. And then oh, Marcus, he... We needed fight choreography. Yeah. Oh, okay. Well, and then Marcus, obviously, he brings, like, he is the man to go to if you need to buy something cosplay-related. And he really wanted to be a part of the buying your cosplay panel, but I guess they didn't have room for you. So yeah. It was kind of dumb, but... A, a lot of these panels are... Small. Very thrown. Well, they're well, very thrown I, together. I just don't understand why they're having it all outside. It's just, it's kind of inconvenient, you know. Just because it's one venue and it's hard to get oh, so much. True, yeah. Have that one like, um, honestly, like instead of the Grand Pavilion, we should have performed on the next stage. That, and yeah. apparently, like last year, there were there ones was like that happened like over at the hotel. Yeah, and stuff that's like what that. I heard I guess, too. I'm just guessing this year, like okay, you know, it yeah. just it just was an oversight. Yeah. 
But, you know, like, yeah, we each bring, like, a unique thing. Um, Chelsea, who was just on here, uh, thank you for, she didn't say thank you, or, but I really appreciate her taking my spot while I was getting things yeah. up. Uh, she is also, she were actually worked with Andromeda in the costume shop, so she knows how to sew as well. Right. And then we also have photo editors and cinematographers. We have, like... You know, we try to bring in anyone, no matter what, because we like to, or at least I like to think that we can turn any skill set into something cosplay related. Yeah. yeah. I, love I, I love how, like, all of you guys have your own speciality. It's like, honestly, seriously, just like the vendors are like, okay, I can bring this skill to the table. Yeah. You and you can't do. Right? Yeah, exactly. Uh, yeah. It, God, what I was going to say again. <laughs> like you said just a little bit ago, once you've been talking for so long, I'm, I'm like <laughs> thinking of all the time. Yeah. It's oh, like no, the name of this fine. episode. It's like yeah. that's what I was about to say. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah. But uh, I guess with really my skill set, I I let my uh, my teammates know, hey, you guys, this is how you buy your cosplay online. This is where you go see. This is what you should be spending it on. And you know, I like to do a little bit of photo editing. I actually showed Carter a photo of my Daredevil. My pre suit, black suit, oh. Daredevil. And he yeah. thought it was. I thought it was straight from the Netflix series. Here, yeah, show, show him the picture. It looks straight from the Netflix, like, thumbnail. It, it was just. See phenomenal. if I could actually pull that up real quick. If I could yeah. Find it. Carter's a really good photo editor, too. He's done a lot of I'm okay. Yeah. I'm okay. He did a birthday present for me. Like, mm -hmm. I'm also, I was president of the Nelly Dancing Club. He did a lot of work for our posters and things. I was like, Carter, do this. <laughs> Put together, huh? Dude. That looks straight from the Netflix series, doesn't it? Dude! Yeah! <laughs> and that's, I, that's I saw that the for the suit. first time, and I didn't, this is before I met Marcus, and I'm like, oh, he just pulled the freaking thumbnail from Netflix. And then he sent that to me, like, as a part of his cosplay um, photos montage he wanted me yeah. to put in. And I'm like, wait, the whole time that was really him? Oh, doesn't <laughs> it look straight from, the, from like, the yeah. straight thumbnail from the Netflix series? Yeah. It is that is rad. And then like he's edited me. I've worn his Power Ranger outfit. He's like edited me into the the for the to the foreground of like the Power Rangers base or something. Yeah, I let Carter try on my uh, Dino Charge Silver Ranger cosplay, and you know, I was almost kind of disappointed because that suit almost worked well more with him than it did with me. And it like a lot <laughs> I got a custom made for you, right? Yeah, it was yeah. definitely custom made for me. But it seems like my friends when they try on my cosplay, it's like, okay, you definitely look way better than that than me. Right. Yeah. <laughs> like, oh, this, oh. See now, what have we learned? Stop letting your friends wear your costume. You're like, no, I like this one. Yeah, no. I like this yeah. One. <laughs> but Carter, he definitely pulls off a great, great Power Ranger. That's why I'm going to help him next year become the uh, Green Ranger. I so, uh, he, I, I, we got to get you into an anime, into a One Punch Man, like a tank top carrot guy from it, One Punch Man. No, so. I'll make him cyborg. Oh, like the, the the cyborg guy oh, with the Gino, arms. Genos. That's, yeah. that's who I've yeah. watched. The episodes I did watch when they fought that, uh, what that? The yeah, Mosquito Lady. Yeah, yeah, Mosquito yeah. Lady. Yeah, I saw him and I'm like, oh, that guy is so bad. I will so help you build those arms. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> exactly, so, yeah. Oh, I man. definitely wanted to do that. You know, dye my hair blonde again. Man, I went blonde. What? He's blonde, right? Yeah. yeah. yeah he's I went, blonde. I'm yeah. trying to imagine. Blonde gets you, like, get to do those completely, like, black, black, black uh, eyes. Yeah. 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 I went blonde back when, I think when I was, when I got out of high school, my first year out of high school, <laughs> I went blonde and, uh, I I have a hard time seeing that. Oh yeah, me too. People compared me to because uh, I had my hair real short, and I uh, for my job at the time, I had to wear this chest or this hat because I worked as a dishwasher, yeah. and, it, and it really flattened my hair. So people compared me to a uh, like an early two thousands, you know, Eminem. Cause it's oh, wow. hair, yeah, you want to know the thing is. <laughs> hair, well, you want to know like the thing is I always say Jenos kind of just looks like a um, a K-pop star. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> yeah, exactly. Uh huh. Yeah, so okay, he can pull can off like it. the yeah, yeah, yeah it's like, just the contacts and he just the, the hair. The K-pop star. The K-pop hair. Oh, yeah. yeah. I can see you playing that really well. Yeah, yeah that will. Maybe I should work on that next year. You say yeah, that, exactly. or you will get you a bomb yeah. wig. Yeah. Yes. Ooh. Oh, yes. Yes. Ooh. Oh. Way more excited. Yeah, I was gonna try. <laughs> Yeah, you can be the, uh, you can join us and be that, I don't remember his name. I'll do the bicycle guy. <laughs> oh, Moomin Rider. Oh, I gotta tell you, there was a, at, uh, she, she was with me at, no, not at Anime Oasis, at, um, at San Diego oh, Comic Con. Okay. There was a Moomin Rider in a wheelchair. And he, yes. he, it was the best Moomin Rider I've ever seen. Yes. And it was His so, was really well it was done. so I was like, impressed. Yeah. It's like, wow. Yeah. 
No, but you, I don't remember his name. There's the black guy in One Punch Man. That is, I'm having I don't such remember a tough name. time remembering. Yeah, him. you can I, join us if we can. Yeah, I will so do this. Yeah. You're right, I can't yeah, remember his yeah, name. Yeah, he's not that popular, unfortunately. Yeah. <laughs> Most of the characters yeah. that I do are popular. Are you kidding me? Cyborg's pretty popular. This, this is the one. The one. <laughs> okay. the Hashtag one. plans for Fan X 19. 2019, yep. yeah. Yep. 2019 plans. Exactly. This will happen. This right, will I'm happen. I'm just going to make yes. sure the camera's still running. Thank you for yeah, that would be disappointing. But I would definitely do that One Punch Man cosplay. What was his name? Sai? Genos. 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 Yeah. Genos. I would yeah. definitely, definitely love to do that. And then it would right. definitely be a, a duo. I love it. Absolutely love it. Well, yeah, it's like we're, we're getting ready to go and come up a little bit over on time here. What, okay. what, what, what was? That's a picture of Carter as Saitama and me and Tatsuma. That was before a San Diego Comic Con. Yeah. Yes. 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 Uh, yeah. Okay, yeah, we're, making, we're making this group. Yeah. We are making this group. <laughs> so meeting new friends, <laughs> making new groups. Yeah, yeah, exactly, uh -huh. yeah. There we go. See, that, that's Snake what happens at every con. single con. You're just like, yes. oh my god! Okay, we're doing a thing. <laughs> like, yeah. You need to hand over your contact information immediately because yeah, I need absolutely. to be able to get in contact with you as soon exactly. as possible. Exactly. Yeah. Exactly. <laughs> there you go. Well, like I said, while, while we're kind of wrapping things up, where can people go and see examples of your guys' work? How can they go and get in touch with uh, Snake River Defenders? Well, uh, again, I'm Marcus Moss, or Shining Brave on Instagram. And uh, you know, I'm trying to keep my Instagram and all a lot of cosplay related, but a lot of people are saying I should post, post more. And if you don't really see a lot, go check out my Facebook page, just Marcus Moss. You should see uh, my 360 photo with Thor and St. Thomas. So. Yeah. 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 And My name's Andromeda Wheeler. I don't really have a cosplay Instagram or Facebook, mm -hmm. but you can uh, see any of the cosplays I've done on uh, Carter's Instagram and Facebook. I just have to say real quick, Andromeda, that's just a perfect, perfect name. I, yeah. Yeah. Really yeah. You want to know, awesome when she name. first told me her name, I didn't think it was real. I thought she was making a fake name for me. <laughs> <laughs> Trying to brush you off like, yeah. Okay, yeah. Just, I was just like, I, I knew who Andromeda was because I loved the, like Perseus and, yeah. and the, that Greek myth, but then she said her name was Andromeda. I'm like, oh, that's a great name. That almost is too perfect to be real. So, so it looks like <laughs> Spider-Man Infinity War. So yeah. we're using her made-up name, so, huh? Oh, yeah, I'm Spider-Man. Exactly. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> See? See? It's all right. We'll, we'll get you to use your real name. We will. Yeah. Someday. It's a galaxy. <laughs> it's a galaxy, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, like okay, turn around, show on the back of your shirt. We got custom made handler shirts, and yes! the other handler has a shirt with her kind of name on it, her handler like name. handler name Those on it. Those shirts turned out so amazing. No, they oh, they really good. did. Those were like kind of put together last minute too. Three bucks at Walmart. Yeah. <laughs> there you go. There exactly. you go. Yep. And yours. Oh yeah. So my name is Carter Lee. You can find me on really just Instagram at Iron underscore Eagle underscore underscore cosplay. I don't have a Facebook page. You can friend me at Carter Lee, I guess. I don't know. Uh, yeah, and then the Snake River Defenders, just look up on, look them up on Facebook. Snake River Defenders. Yeah. I think yeah. Matt Asbo and uh, Chelsea definitely oh. keep it updated. Yeah, yeah. I'll um, just quick shout out to those two. Um, Chelsea is, uh, who's our black cat, yeah, is Kid's sister. It's really hard to spell it's yeah. like with an x yeah or something like that you can go check out her somewhere. table if you want yeah, yeah. and then matt asbo who's our moon knight um he is urban webhead on facebook oh, yeah on facebook i know yeah. he has an instagram but i don't think he keeps that yeah i think i think both chelsea and, and matt keep their yeah, have more facebook cosplay pages not instagram whereas like marcus and i are more Perfect. I'll still I'll still be tagging. Oh every, no no! All you, you guys too, man. inside this. We so, gotta yeah. we gotta get a picture yeah. with you too, man. What's, uh, where can we find you? Yeah. Uh, so you can you can find me oh, over at Crack Brain Cos Pod for okay. things of the podcast mm -hmm. and then cosplay stuff. That's more mine or like the entire group of us. Just the Crack Brain. Okay. On Instagram and everything else. The so. Crack Brain, all one word. Yep. All right. I think I should yep. specify my name because I forgot the underscore. How important that is. It is. Uh, yeah. <laughs> yeah. So that's why I wanted to. That's why I was saying the underscore. Well. Yeah. So mine's at shining underscore brave on Instagram. Yeah, go, go check us out. We, and I'd love to talk to you guys. Yeah. Thank well, you for having us. Yeah. Thank yeah. you so yeah. much for this having us. Out amazing. I know. I'm actually now really motivated to go and find a way to get back up over here. Like we need to do another. Oh episode. yes. We need to do another. Episode. Yeah. Well, like you know, something that we want to do is actually make films and, yeah. and, and stuff like that. Oh yeah. And uh, you're, you guys are based in Salt Lake. Right? Yeah. Oh, I'm sure we can make our way down. Yeah. To oh yeah. Salt Lake. We we yeah. we've got 
I've actually got something I will be talking to you guys about yes. right as soon as these are yeah, off. Yeah, we'll, we'll exchange so. real, our, our contact information once the mics come off. Yes! So, yeah, yeah. Real quick, if you don't mind me saying, I, cool. I tried to start a, a YouTube page uh, called Breaking Ground. It was between me and Matt, and that went well for a while. We got like... 14 subscribers, and that, that's not a lot, but it's a lot to me, and I think my mom yeah. and my sister is two of them, so. no. <laughs> anyway, uh, it's, that, that, Same. <laughs> yeah, same, we 14. Yeah. But uh, our uh, YouTube page, it went for a while, and then we almost started running out of ideas, or really we started planning for the Snake River Con, so we have a, we, we recorded like 30 or 40 episodes, you know, threw up on YouTube, but Matt wrote, never really edited them. And then we just almost lost interest in the whole YouTube thing. And now, it's like, maybe we should start doing podcasts. It's yeah. a, it's, like I said, podcasts, and it, it's, I'm telling you, it's fun. Yeah, it's it fun. It definitely is. Just, well, you, you know, just get to kind of let loose, relax, and just talk. Yeah. So it's like... Really fun, yeah. It, it gives it gives you guys a reason to like have to hang out with each other. Yeah. So it's like <laughs> yeah, hey, we have exactly. to hang out because we have to record. So exactly, yeah. but yeah, thank you so much for having us. So we will we'll stay in touch and we'll 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 do some projects. Right, that'll be, awesome, that'll yeah. be great. Hopefully, you'll have us back. That's, yeah, that's absolutely. Sure. Yeah. Definitely yeah, we'll will. try to get some of the defenders here so you can get a more yeah, closer yeah, with, look. With yeah. Awesome oh yeah, Matt's get over Matt there. We'll Chelsea probably just get them right here. Why they wanted to start the SRD? Yeah, they were the founders. Yeah. There we go, then yeah, we'll get that going. So until next time, people, we will talk to y'all later. Tell me pretty lies, look me in the face, tell me that you love me, even if it's fake.